Hello everyone, it's Bing from Kodak Alaris. Just looking to see how easy it is to set up SharePoint with SmartTouch today. So if I open up my SmartTouch settings, I can look at all the workflows for scanning that I already have configured. And when you first install SmartTouch, it does come with some pre-configured workflows ready to go. I have created a scan to SharePoint here. Uh, what I'm going to do is just check out how I set that up to see how easy it was. So I'll change to my scan to SharePoint workflow. If I go to configure settings, um, all I had to do was enter the site, which you can copy and paste from your browser. My username and password, of course, to log into that server. And from there, I can pick which folder I require these documents to go. So in this case, I created a special document library within SharePoint to house my documents that have been scanned from SmartTouch. So from there, I can select my folder OK. There are some other settings that we can change, but I'm going to leave it as is for now. And that's all I had to do to have that ready to go. So if we look at our sample document here, we have an insurance claim report. I'm going to put that in there ready to go. From Smart Touch, I can select Scan to SharePoint. We can see there's my button. So that document's now scanned through. We will get a confirmation that the document has actually been uploaded to SharePoint successfully. So if I go back to the home directory of my SharePoint site, we can see now that we've successfully uploaded one file to SharePoint. So what I'm now going to do is go to my document library within SharePoint. And we can see that we do have one file listed here and it was modified a few seconds ago. So let's open up that file. And we can see there is our claim report. Good to go. So that's how easy it is to set up scan to SharePoint. Uh, using SmartTouch, which is a free piece of software that comes with our amazing Kodak Alaris scanners. Alaris. Makes sense.